Hey guys, it's your buddy Rome. We're back on the desk taking a look at a new product that was sent out to me for review. As a photographer, many of you know we have a lot of challenges when it comes to setting up our cameras and getting the right camera angle. Today what we're going to look at is a tripod extension arm. This arm will extend out to 42 inches. Uh, it has the ability to do 360 rotation. It comes with a number of accessories. We'll talk about those and also the build quality of this. Now this will support up to 22 pounds, which is outstanding. All right, so in the box, or should I say in the bag, we're greeted with a few things as you guys can see here. So let's start off with the first thing that we see here, which is this little phone holder. Now, a lot of people like myself uh, have used phones, iPhones, Android phones, you know, for content creation. So it's really nice that they provide you uh, with this little phone holder and it has two quarter 20s, one on the back and one here at the bottom. So depending on how you want to place your phone, you're going to be pretty much good to go. That's in the bag. You also get some other accessories. You get an Allen key and you get this little uh, ring that goes on the back of this. So you're going to need this. Let's go ahead and pop this out so you guys can see what this looks like. That's that ring that goes onto the back of this. Really nice. And we also get a little carabiner. That may come in handy for your sandbag if you want to clip it on or hang it off of something like this little ring here. You could always use it that way. That's another option uh, for securing everything. All right, guys, starting off, you can see this is made from very high grade aluminum. Everything about this is machined very nicely. They even provided you with this little, um, uh, I guess a little sign here to remind you which direction to rotate this. Now, like I said, this will, as small as you see it here on the table, will extend out to 42 inches in length. And that is achieved by rotating these little uh, knobs here. And if you rotate these like so, it's going to free up, you know, the um, inner tube. You have another one here that you can also adjust and it's gonna do basically the same thing. So remember you have locking and uh, unlock here. So to lock is this direction, to unlock is this direction. And then you could just pull this out like you guys see here, and that's gonna give you even more extension uh, for this. Now, the at the very end here, you can see where you would mount your um, fluid head if you wanted to attach a fluid head to this. This just uh, goes on right here. So you just take off this little end cap like so, and that gives you access to this uh, piece right here. Now on this end, this is where this goes. So you're just gonna line this up and you're gonna screw that in until it's tight. Now you could use a little bit of Loctite on this or you could use um, maybe that Allen key to better seat this, you know, just to tighten it in there really nice so you don't have to worry about that coming out. All right, so you have somewhat of a fluid head here that is a component of this. And what this is gonna allow you to do is once you have this at the proper angle that you want and you have that locked down onto your tripod, you're just gonna turn this little uh, knob here that's going to lock that in place so it doesn't move but you still have the ability to rotate this 360 degrees you're just going to release that and that's going to give you the freedom as you guys see here to rotate this so if this was already attached to a tripod this would still have the freedom to move your 360 so if you're doing like some panoramic photography or something like that that's going to really come in handy all right so let's mount this on a tripod and take a closer look at it Okay guys, so before we go over and take a look at our extension on the tripod, I want to show you guys this uh, sandbag that you're going to get with this. This is gonna allow you to add rocks or sand or anything you want to inside here for stability. And this little sandbag will just fit over the rod or connect to the rod like I showed you guys before. So you have two sections here Obviously for it to have balance, it has to be equal. So here we go, on both sides, you can fill this with rocks or sand or pebbles or whatever it is you want to, uh, weights or whatever you wanna put inside of this to balance this out. And then it's gonna just fit over the rod. Now, as you guys can see, it has a really nice faux leather material. 
Um, this is that um, anti-rip kind of polyester, really nice zippers on this. So this should last you a long time. And you know, the cool thing about these sandbags is you can use them for a variety of different things. So that's great that that comes in the, uh, in the box. Okay guys, as you can see here, we have it now mounted on a tripod. This still has the ability to rotate. So if we wanted to do 360 on this, we could. We could also rotate this all the way in the opposite direction. Now, of course, you have the ability to adjust this based on the length that you need and the counterbalance weight that you're gonna be able to use uh, with this is outstanding, that you have that little uh, sandbag here at the end. And as far as the uh, front component here, check this out. So we could easily bring this back in and we could attach you know, whatever type of fluid head or device we wanted to connect to this. So say for instance, you had a GoPro that you wanted to use or a smartphone or even a larger camera, you know, mirrorless camera, something like that, that's gonna be ideal. And I love the flexibility of this to be able to easily rotate this and position this however I need. And you also have the flexibility, as you see here, of changing the angle of this at any time and just locking that angle in, that's gonna be perfect for your top-down type of uh, photos and videos. Yes, you can use this photography as well. So yeah, a lot of cool features built in uh, to this extension rod for a tripod. So hopefully guys, this video has been helpful uh, to help you guys make a decision. I think this is gonna become a permanent part of my studio. All right guys, it's been Rome with Rome Knows Tech and I will catch you all in the next video. Peace, I'm out.